in the world comes the development of trust. One has to, to develop trust in the Holy Spirit. One has to develop a trust in the unseen as being the, the actually the reality of things, and to follow that, to lay aside the investment in the world. Without the development of trust, you know, the belief in sacrifice um, clicks in because it's a very, very deep um, cornerstone of the ego's thought system. And that, that belief uh, is so deep that it's perceived uh, as a sacrifice to give up the, the things or the, the valuing of, uh, of the world, the, the ordering and the judgment, the hierarchy of illusion. So the mind really has to have some confidence that there's something else it's going toward before it's willing to let loose of what it knows. Yes. If we try to even throw a definition of sacrifice out, we go back to the teacher's manual, around 32, page 32 and 33 or so, what is the real meaning of sacrifice, then we, we get that sacrifice always means the giving up of what you want. Mm -hmm. And what, O oh holy child of God, do you want? To, you know, the, the, the question comes up in a kind of a rhetorical, kind of a sarcastic sense, you know, is it a sacrifice to give up pain 